Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Uh, good morning everyone. Okay, see. Okay, we meet again in our class uh, mathematics di mathematics DLP year 4. We still in unit 4 time. So today we're going to see about addition and subtraction of time. Jadi hari ini kita nak tengok tentang penambahan dan penolakan masa eh ataupun waktu okey everyone you can refer to your textbook you can turn to page 152 okey alright okey you can see a few example there okey now let we go to page 153 Okay, let me try question number 2. Okay. Read the information given. State the total time taken by Hakimi in weeks and days to read all the books. Alright, so how are we going to perform addition? Jadi macam mana kita nak buat untuk operasi penambahan uh, melibatkan waktu ataupun masa eh? You can refer to the table given. Awak boleh rujuk dekat jadual yang diberi itu. Jadi, we can perform standard return here. Jadi, kita boleh buat uh, kaedah bentuk lazim dekat sini. So, we can write 4 weeks. five days. Plus. 6 days plus 2 weeks 4 days ok Okay, so 5 plus 6, we got 11. Plus 4, we got 15. So this one, 15 days. Alright, 4 plus 2, we got 6. Okay, this which this means 6 weeks. So now we got 6 weeks. Ah, uh, Sorry. So now we got 6 weeks and 15 days. Okay, but we know that uh, 1 week equal to 7 days. So that's why we have to this one 15 we minus with with 14 because 2 weeks equal to 14 days. Okay, bila kita, sebab kita tahu 2 minggu bersamaan dengan 14 hari. So dekat sini kita tolak 14. Yang dekat weeks ni kita tambah 2 eh. Kalau sini kita tolak 7, sini kita tambah 1. So now we got 1 Okay, one day. Here we got eight. Eight weeks. Okay, so the answer is eight weeks eh, and one day. Jadi jawapan dia adalah lapan minggu dan satu hari. Okay, let we see about subtraction of time. Okay, you can see a few example there. Okay, you can refer to page 155. Okay, now let we go to another page, 156. Okay, let we try question number 3. Okay, 5 weeks, 2 days, minus with 6 days. Okay, we know that we cannot minus 2 minus 6, we cannot perform. Okay, kita tak boleh nak tolak 2, uh, 2 nak tolakkan dengan 6, tak boleh. So, we have to take 1 week from 5. Okay, kita kena ambil 1 minggu daripada 5 ni. So, this one become 4. Okay, this one, 1 week. Okay, we know that 1 week equal to 7 days. So, this number 2. Jadi nombor 2 ni akan berubah jadi 9 sebab 2 tambah 7 sama dengan 9. So 9 eh. So 2 plus 7 we got 9. 
then we can perform the subtraction. Baru kita boleh tolak. 9 minus 6, we got 3. Okay. This one 4, we just copy. Again, so we got 4 weeks. And 3 days. Okay, very easy. Okay, how about number 5? Okay, let me try question number 5. Okay. 10 years, 7 months. Okay, 10 years, 7 months. Minus 1 year, 9 months. Okay, so 7 minus 9. Again, we cannot perform the subtraction. We have to take 1 year from here, from 10. Also, this one will become 9. Okay, now 1 year we know that equal to... 12 months, so 7 plus 12, we will get 19. Okay, so this one will become 19. So 19 minus 9, we get 10. This one, 9 minus 1, we got 8. So the answer is 8 year and 10 months. Okay, so this is the answer. Okay, I hope all of you, you enjoy our lesson today. So, see you again in our next uh, class. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Have a nice day. Bye.